there be a little bit more inclusion yes. in the Indian community? For example, if you when are... Does she meant to say when it comes to marriages? Yes. yes. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> like, are they okay with marrying a black, African or this? Ah, uh, that's... the. <laughs> Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's another day in uh, Nairobi, Kenya. We are heading out. Also, I switched uh, my apartment. We are in this beautiful apartment. Let me show you this. It's at the river side. Actually, the apartment where I was staying yesterday, I wasn't so comfortable there. Uh, though there were Indian community living in there but uh, I wasn't comfortable with the room that I got so I just thought I'll uh, change so today we are staying here at the riverside let me just tell you that apartment is really beautiful and the price that I'm paying it's it's way too cheap you know it's cheaper than what I was paying yesterday and day before yesterday. It's just $25 a day. And I just spoke to the lady. She said, uh, if you want to continue for a couple of days more, I can uh, give you a discount. She's such a sweet lady, I must say. Uh, anyways, we're just waiting for Ivan. He should be here somewhere. Uh, and then uh, we plan to roam around in the city again today's vlog would be interesting because uh, i plan to visit the indian uh, community here who've been staying for years and years in uh, kenya and now they've uh, built uh, their own locality wherein you find uh, all indians they have schools for themselves hospitals and let me just go and see for myself i'll take you along with me they say that they don't allow any uh, kenyans to you know live there we'll find that out i think ivan is right there yes <laughs> even he is uh, vlogging sometimes it's get it gets difficult you know to vlog <laughs> when we with the two bloggers hanging all three you we'll have one more person will be joining us three bloggers together hi mr Ivan. Hi. do we have uh, miss the traveling miss along we, with we're us we're going to get her right now <laughs> okay you were closer to us to where she was oh okay so no we got problem. her information we're going to pick her up how are you doing today doing great yeah really excited to visit the in the community today to visit your home at home <laughs> okay guys okay. so this is uh, priya who's actually from india and she's been eating a lot of diverse meals here she's been eating indian food <laughs> <laughs> yeah i've been eating just indian since the time i'm here in uh, kenya this is a much nicer place yeah it is it is you know i was just telling them if you see the buildings here yeah they are so well maintained and you know the apartment where i am staying yeah it's so beautiful i'll uh, maybe today or tomorrow i'll give you a tour of my apartment i'm sharing it with a with a french lady okay nice yeah so guys meet uh meet those who don't know indian food is actually my favorite food in the world <laughs> it is is it? Uh, it is i love indian food is it just for the camera or in real no no for real but what i didn't know is the vegetarian version mm -hmm. that priya has introduced me to <laughs> i didn't know about vegetarian indian food so that's a new discovery all right and um it's been fun i'm eating healthy so that's gonna be a, that's that was a good experience but as far as the indian community is concerned this is a new thing for me i always thought this was just like immigrants mm -hmm. i didn't know people were here from generations 
Mm. So to call him Indian is actually inaccurate. They are Kenyans for yeah. all intended purposes. You know, so it's gonna be good to go in the community and learn how they live and how life is for them here. Yeah, for me as well, yeah, it'll be interesting to see. Yeah. How they live here. I hope we get someone uh, living there whom we can interview and you know try yeah. to understand. Question, yeah. Priya, have yeah. you noticed the difference in the names from these uh, Kenyans from India here compared to people in India, or the, the names the same? Uh, you are talking about the Indians living in Kenya? Yes. No, they've got the Indian name only. Only Indian yeah. name? Yeah. Okay. So the person who I was speaking to, he's my subscriber by the way. Uh, his name is Praveen. Okay. He is living here since uh, the age of six. And wow. now he is married. He has two children. He's inviting you. I, I hope I get a chance to meet him. Yeah. But still he has an Indian name here. So I'm pretty sure all Indians living here uh, have an Indian name. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Let's find out more. Yeah, we will. We will. <laughs> <laughs> it's too hot now, by the way. I yeah. got, got a jacket for myself. Yeah. Because uh, yesterday it was cold. Yeah, so weather cold. is very uncertain. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Even he's laughing. It's too uncertain. You never know when it'll rain. That's right. <laughs> because I've carried everything today. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, because I'm wearing a like a crop top. Yeah. If it's too hot. We don't wear the jacket, if it's cold, we wear the jacket. <laughs> Raju or Patel. <laughs> no, but I just realized this is um, a Kutch community as far as I know. See, I can see Sri Kutch Satsang and uh, the bus it reads as Sri Swami Narayan something something. So basically, uh, the caste, the Hindu caste that is living here could be probably Kutch or Gujarati or Jain. We get to know once we, you know, go inside. Time for the school children to leave, I think. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. Are no, so they are picking up children this from uh, there. Yeah, that's where you know you could see traffic there. Is. That is cool. Oh. We're just getting down now. This is the Indian community that we were talking about. Uh, it's right here in Langata and uh, we're just walking let's yeah. just see if we can find someone whom we can speak to you know <laughs> it's a task you know, to talk to someone yeah okay so i want to tell you what i meant by coming to uh, priya's people priya <laughs> <laughs> yeah I what did i mean by bringing you to your people yeah, it's basically an indian community staying here <laughs> but i also find african uh, kenyans uh, Walking by. But these Indians are Kenyans too. This, they hear you say they're not Kenyan, they'll be very pissed. <laughs> be like, I don't know, I honestly am unaware about the anything. I'm just trying to call, speak to them yeah. and get to know more about them. What I mean, I mean, they, they felt a very, what is it called? Deep, um, segregated from the local people mm -hmm. because they were not recognized in the constitution as, a, as Kenyans mm -hmm. until very recently. Oh, okay. Indians in Kenya. So very recently now they're, they're, oh. they're, they're Kenyans. Eh? Hi. So, <laughs> so you're going to, talk to They're me. going to the school. Yeah. So do you feel right at home? Were you born? No, you were born here. I don't. <laughs> I can tell you only when I get to meet them and speak to them. Honestly, I'm trying to pull her. <laughs> okay, but is it true that uh, they don't allow uh, Kenyan citizen or the Africans to live here? No, they stay, but they stay down there. Down there. And you're on in from the, here. They only Kachi. Only Kachi. Kachi who stay here. Yeah. Okay, so if an uh, African wants to buy a house here, he won't be allowed? No. Oh, okay. And what about the school that you'll go to? It's a Kachi school? This is Kachi school. Okay. But it is mixed. Mixed. Even Africans can come here, uh, you know, get an admission here easily? Yes. Oh, that's nice. Nice to meet you. Nice like to meet you. Yeah. You look so beautiful. <laughs> you too. You are more prettier than me. <laughs> Bye.
All right. Very nice people. I got to speak to them. So they were saying there's nothing like that. Even an African can uh, uh, stay, but they don't stay exactly in these buildings. This is the building where you find the Kutch casting. It's um, uh, basically a caste in Hindu religion. Uh, but if the Africans wants to stay, they have to stay down there. And uh, the school, of course, belongs to the Kachi Samaj, so only uh, you'll find Indians studying in there. You've got a lady here. Is she here to sell something? Yeah, they're selling stuff. Oh, what are they selling? Clothes. They're selling clothes. Do, do they live? Saturday. 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 You're moving. You've already closed. Yeah, you already closed. Yeah. Oh, okay. But do they live here in this no, area? they don't live here. They just come to sell here on Saturday. Oh, Wednesday, and Saturday and Friday. Oh, okay. They come. They have, on Saturday, Wednesday and Friday, they have like a market. Uh -huh. It's in the morning hours. Uh -huh. So now they're closing. They're packing up. Oh, yeah. I see. Wow, they told me so much about this place. <laughs> I, I had no idea. I had no idea all these things. Like, like what? Uh, what? Because I didn't know this place existed. I asked when they they started uh, mm -hmm. building. Apparently, in the 2000s. Uh -huh. um, and yeah, there's uh, Africans on this side. Yeah. Indians on this and side. On this side. But this one is also mixed, pretty much mixed. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. That's what even I got to know. So this was built like only like two decades ago. 2000s. Yes. Yeah, two decades ago. Oh, so pretty recent, I would say. Very recent. Yeah. That's why I've never even heard of it, because I'm like, I was like, oh, what is this guy? <laughs> yeah. I didn't know it existed. Yeah. But, 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 this is such a beautiful area. Mm. Look at the roads. I mean, so sidewalks, clean. So clean. Lots of school kids all wearing uniform. There's discipline. But I really want to enter behind these gates and see what's going on. Now. That's really what I'm trying For to For that, do. you'll have to take an admission inside the school. Oh, is that right? <laughs> yeah, and you'll have to be an Indian citizen for, uh, sorry, a Kutch. I was talking to one of the kids, they told me you don't have to be native Indian to in enter. I don't know if it's true. Not enter, but uh, I just spoke to a girl who was telling me, basically this belongs to a Kutch caste in Hindu religion. And, uh, wow. Yeah. So can you enter? <laughs> I, if I get an admission, I, how can you enter a school? <laughs> <laughs> you saying if I can enter the school or no? So of course, they'll have certain rules and regulations. They can't let yeah. any visitor enter the yeah, that's school. True. There's small children going in the school. Yeah. yeah. What if anyone goes and does something? But there, there has to be security. It's a security, 100%. Yeah. So we, I, like, I don't know. I wouldn't want to interrupt yeah. with. Yeah. Yeah, security and policies. Wow. Yeah. How do you feel about being here right now? I feel good, yeah. You know, Indians are always shy. You know, I came across a couple of uh, school going the yeah. kids. Yeah. They were a little shy in the beginning to appear in front of the camera. Then yes. they came in running just to say hi. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, and then they opened up, you know. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Okay, let's go try get get inside. Let's try. Yeah. You know, yeah, but we'll still try to get inside the school. Yeah, let's try to get inside. <laughs> okay. Knows? They could, so I, I don't think they'll allow us to go into the school, but the mall. Pros, of course, they won't. I'm sure. I got free yeah. For security yes. reasons, yes. 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 To enter the community. Yeah, yeah. But this is the but we will try colony it. We'll get where the Kutch but let's try it. people it's stay. Okay. No, no, this is the colony. This, this is, is residential is area. My God, it's so clean and well maintained. I must say. So let's go ahead and try. I don't think they'll understand. Oh, we can tell. I completely understand for security reasons. The it's people who are residing here, of course, yeah. wouldn't uh, want any any person entering the vicinity. But he right? said we can go to the school and ask for the park. The, the park? Yeah. The park. The park, park, right? What is that? To the school and ask for a person called the park. The and park, okay. The and park. they can let us enter? Yes. Okay. To the school. All right, All right. We thank you check. so much. Uh, but of course, we Asante don't want Asante. to intrude in uh, anyone's, uh, uh, what do you say, how personal do you know space with the national park. Asking. This is how you know they're close to the natural. There's an animal here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then you know you're yeah. close to the natural. Animals is here, yeah, you can go there and check. Um, some animals there? Yeah, there is a national uh, game park. Uh -huh. Game park? Yeah. yeah. No. 
Robigan National Park. Yeah. This is Robigan National Park. This one. This one? Yeah. Defense. Oh. You finished your school? Yeah, yeah, nice. Don't want to go back home. Yes, we're shooting a documentary. Baby. Where is your home? Yeah. You're running? Yes. Yeah. Where, where? Yeah. Yeah. We're shooting a You should go back home. It's. Uh, when did you leave your school? Three. It's three thirty now. Thirty minutes past three. When do you plan to go back home? Okay. No, no. But you should enjoy with your friends, yeah. Good group of friends, I would say. <laughs> they just finished their school at three, and they're just having fun over there. Just uh, talking to them, and they were talking. Uh, they were asking me about my channel. And while I was just showing him on my channel, he's telling me, "Please do not edit us out." No, yeah, I would never do that. You will see yourself. <laughs> nice meeting you, Aryan. Bye. <laughs> so let's continue. Yeah, they're so enthusiastic. You see? Yeah, 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 yeah. Really, uh, very interesting kids, and are going. Yeah. And they were not afraid to come at you and talk. Yeah. So Earlier good. they were shy. Yeah. And then later they came and running. That's how kids are, yeah. Yeah. You know they want to talk. Right. But at the same time they're shy to you know approach you. That's right. When you approach them, they get a little scared. Mm -hmm. But then they come and running. That's so, right. But that that is what has been happening to us for past. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. But Ivan, I wanted to ask you one question yes. with this. Uh, since you live in the U.S. and you see a lot of Indian communities staying in the U.S. as well, right? Like you find the way we find Indians living in Kenya, we've got Hi. Indians. Hi, <laughs> we've got Indians living in uh, US as well, right? So, what do you have to say about that? I, I, uh, as you know, I'm a real estate agent. I sell houses, mm -hmm. so I had the pleasure to deal with many Indian clients, mm -hmm. and I'm very impressed mm -hmm. every time I deal with the Indian family. They rarely come and check out the house alone. Usually, they come as a crew. Somebody will call you and say, I want to check out the house. Next thing you know, you have seven Indians showing up. Oh. You know, the whole family has to kind of approve yes. whatever one person is doing. Yes. So yes. they have a very strong sense of community. Yeah. Very strong. We also have a game called the Spelling Bee in the US, mm -hmm. where they give you words that are very hard to pronounce uh -huh. and hard to write because there might be a silent H or some of the weird letter. Yes. And the main champions, nine times out of ten, are Indian American kids. Oh. So the discipline in the Indian community is something else, you know? Okay. I think a lot of us immigrants in the U.S. have so much to learn about your community. Oh, the yes. discipline, mm -hmm. uh, I don't want to say stereotypes, but the strongest in math and science. Mm -hmm. Some of the most famous doctors in the U.S. are Indian descendants. You see? So Indian. I have nothing but respect for the Indian community. And yeah. I would like to learn what the secret is. I, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yes. For appreciating us. Yes. But then I also wanted to know the Indians which live in the U.S. Uh, do they welcome the um, what do you say Americans or the other communities there, or they are just like here if you see the Kachis? Uh, as far as I know, in the Washington D.C. area, mm -hmm. uh, there's not really an area that I can say is an Indian neighborhood. Okay. You know, people who can afford to live in that area do. Uh -huh. It's more diverse. Okay. You know, I would say there's no such segregation. Okay. Per se. So they live like one family. Maybe Americans, maybe uh, Africans. For Africans, that matter, yeah. white. They all live. And you know, yeah. Southeast Asians. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's more mixed. Okay. Yeah. They live together. Right. Go to go to school together. Exactly. Get educated together. Together. What I don't see though mm -hmm. is uh, interracial marriages within the Indian community. In America? In the U.S. I don't see that much. Here they, to watch. You mean to say they marry an Indian? They only marry themselves. Oh. For the most part. For the most part. Yeah. Even here, you mean to say? Here too. Yeah. Here too. You don't see a lot of interracial marriages between Africans and. Uh, uh, black Kenyans and Indians. Oh, okay. yeah, we don't see a lot of that. Yeah, I know. I know one guy. Uh -huh. I only know one Indian, uh, Ken, Indian African marriage. Uh -huh. and my friend, his dad is Indian, uh -huh. and his mom is Kenyan, uh -huh. and his dad actually got disowned by the family for yeah. mar marrying a, a black woman. <laughs> but they've been together for years because my my friend is an adult. He's my age. Uh -huh. uh, so for all that for all that time, the guy the dad. 
basically has not been talking with his family. Oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe it's because of strong cultural values, you know, that Indian whole they feel like uh, marrying an Indian. Uh, she would understand the Indian culture really well, you know, because an African culture is so different from an Indian culture. For that matter, even an, even uh, when we talk about American culture, maybe for that matter, they yeah. prefer mar marrying within their own but culture. Let me ask you a question. Maybe it will be a little bit controversial. <laughs> am, I, am I Indian? Okay, disclaimer. But, but, disclaim. but, spare, but spare me. I, yeah. Just ask, okay? Yeah. You understand? So, do you feel like? Do you feel like if you're not in India, if you move outside your country and go to live in another country and look Indian, uh -huh. do you feel that you need to assimilate into, not lose all of your culture, right? Uh -huh. But assimilate into those people's culture where you like go to live there. You mean to blend in? Yes. Of course, to, Ivan would be in a better position to answer that since he's been living in uh, America and I'm sure he must have uh, encountered few Indians, yeah. you know? Yeah. Uh, so what do you th think of that? Do Maybe. Indians blend in really well Maybe. in America? Or oh, they blend in extremely well yeah. because they end up making even more money than uh, Caucasians and yeah. Americans. But they keep very, they keep the they, 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 uh, culture very strong. Yeah. I think where she was going with her question was, <laughs> should there be a little bit more inclusion yes. in the yes. Indian community? For example, if you when are it, does she mean to say when it comes to marriages? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very no. specific. No, no. <laughs> like, no. are they okay with marrying a black African or this? Uh, that's then it's a personal choice again. I would say. Uh, yeah, you, you would you would you can't put it that way. But if I know I'm going to get disowned by my family, it's not really a personal choice, yes. you know, because it's like my family uh, versus that, this person that I want to marry. You yeah. Know? Mm -hmm. So I have to choose one or the other. I can't have both. hundred percent. Yeah. So it's not really a personal choice. That's that right. Way, that's right. You know. But okay. I guess it is what it is. It's, uh, it is what it is. Yeah, it, it is, is what it is. It is. <laughs> <laughs> All so right. Guys, this is uh, this is actually the national park. This is Nairobi National Park. Okay. That is Nairobi National Park. Yeah, so right from here, the animals are there. Okay. Whoa! So if you want to go to a game park, you can go here. Just, so imagine, <laughs> this is a this is a, a estate. People live here. Yeah. The lions roaming here. Wow. There's a building like right a residential wow. area, and we've got. Nairobi National Park right there. We can go for a game drive right away. <laughs> oh, I see some construction work going on here. And what it reads as Langata Flats, SCLP Samar. Okay. You see all Indian names here of the businesses that they have. Shah Sahajanan Center. So on the ground floor, um, these are the names of the businesses that you see. They sell vegetables and namkeen and grocery stores and all of that. See, so everything here is Indian. You see so Sonia Jewelers here. There's a departmental store of Indian. Many people who I came across here are from Gujarat Kutch. Is it the Kachi colony? Yeah, Kachi colony would be all. Completely? Yeah, completely Kachi. Oh, nice. So you live somewhere here only? In this, you live in this colony? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, yeah. nice. So we were just trying to, you know, we were just walking around the streets okay. and just trying to understand exactly uh, what community lives here. Because yeah. even I'm from India okay. and I was so surprised to see Indians have a community in Kenya. Okay. So is it recently built here? Yeah. This? Mm -hmm. uh, like, oh, yeah, Varna, yeah. Your temple, you building all temple, yeah, all um, house, uh -huh. your temple. Okay, temple. They're yeah. building the Kutch temple. Yeah, Kutch temple. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And it's been how long that you are staying here? Malo kitna time ho gaya yahan pe? Ja, mujhe koi baara saal ho gaya. Baara saal ho gaya. Dukan level pe isko paanch saal hua. Acha, dukan abhi five years pehle. Chota tha idhar. Haha. Abhi the bara abhi ek saal ho gaya hai. Ek saal ho gaya. But आप बारह साल से केन्या में रह रहे हो कैसा लग रहा है केन्या में चलता है अच्छा है अच्छा लग रहा है लाइफ अच्छा है अपना अपन लग रहा है इंडिया में कैसा लग रहा है आपकी गुजरात की याद आती है आती है इस तेजी में सब कुछ इंडिया में है वो तो सब इंडिया में है इधर तो अभी क्या है इंडिया में जाएगा तो कुछ करने हो जाएगा आपकी फैमिली इधर रहती है इधर ही रहती है ओके एंड तो बेटा है मेरा ना एक लड़की है एक लड़का डेकोरेशन कर रहा है मंडप डेकोरेशन शादी का कुछ माँ है बर्थडे का छोटा लड़का वो शूटिंग कर रहा है लगन का वो डेकोरेशन 
so he was just explaining what businesses his family is into he has this small departmental shop his brother is into event planning and uh, the other one is into uh, the interiors mm. that's really interesting yeah and he says though i'm here for past uh, like for a decade now but he still misses india he feels homely here because all indians stay here mm. but still he misses india that's really nice yeah it was nice meeting you sir so what's your name karsan karsan yeah. okay ah, okay so he moved to kenya from india as an adult yeah ah. uh, it's been 12 years for him that he is here okay yeah uh, how good is your sahili this is sahili how good is your sahili you know guys sahili this will come sir ओके <laughs> 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 मैं हरियाणवी हूँ बट मैं पली पढ़ी मुंबई में थी उधर ही पूरा जन्म हुआ है और अभी ये तो सिर्फ घूमने आई हूँ हाँ इंडिया से दो तीन दिन में चली जाऊंगी बट ये जब सुना ना मैंने नाम आई वॉज वेरी एक्साइटेड कि मैं यहाँ पे आके देखूँ सब और सारे मिडिल क्लास रहते हैं कि नहीं पैसे वाले सब भाई नीचे अभी बाजी में माउथ भी है अपर मिडिल क्लास रहते हैं अच्छा ओके सो इट्स फॉर एवरी वन नाइस ऑल राइट सर बाय थैंक यू नाइस मीटिंग यू ओके बाय बाय सो गेट आउट so he was just telling me uh, that you find uh, all classes like the middle class the upper middle class indians living in here and they are really really happy they are really happy that they you know they are doing something for themselves they're building businesses and trying to settle in here and blend in with the kenyan culture you see he started speaking swahili too he understands swahili yeah this area is a little touch Yeah, all of it is cuts here. Oh, you're selling Indian food here, dabili and pani puri. I wouldn't mind trying, yeah. Uh, okay, I'll I'll uh, I would want to try that. But Bhavesh, I wanted to ask you one question. It's been how long that you moved into Kenya? Around four five years. Four five years. So it's been five years for you. And how do you find uh, Kenya? <laughs> you miss india very much very much okay uh, but are you able to you know aapko inke sath kaam karne mein acha lag raha hai blend in ho pa rahe ho inke sath inke culture ke sath ab to bahut time ho gaya isliye koi dikkat nahi aa rahi dikkat nahi aa rahi sahili samajh mein aati hai sab kuch aata hai that's nice mujhe janana tha jab aap yahan pe aaye the तो इमिग्रेशन में आपको कुछ तकलीफ प्रोसेस में कुछ तकलीफ हुई थी लाइक यू नो एक बिजनेस सेटअप करना यहाँ पे डिफिकल्ट होता है ना केन्या में तो आपको कुछ दिक्कत आई थी नहीं हम तो बहुत टाइम पहले आ गए थे ना तो वो थोड़ी सी दिक्कत दे रहे थे हाँ हाँ ठीक है वो थी। लेकिन अब वो नहीं है अच्छा बट कुछ कुछ क्राइटेरिया होता है यहाँ पे एज इन क्या वो आपका जो प्रॉपर्टी है वो सब दिखाना अच्छा क्या करने कौन सा बिजनेस है हाँ 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 अच्छा वो सब दिखाना पड़ता है और लाइक एक कैपिटल होना चाहिए ना आपके पास यहाँ पे बिजनेस करने के लिए वो भी बताना पड़ता है अच्छा ओके ही इज मेकिंग पानी पूरी या वील पानी पूरी सो दीज आर दार्जेस दापेली Just one twenty uh, shillings. Pani puri one fifty. Whoa. Sir, what's your good name? Nara. Bhai. Nara. <laughs> Nara. <laughs> okay. Nice. You want to try? Of course. We'll make <laughs> three plates. Just yeah, three plates. So what what are you uh, recommending? What okay. is not spicy? <laughs> we try one pani puri, one sweet puri. Is it what? Which one's not spicy? Because I'm not trying anything that's spicy. Ah, today we'll get to know. So spicy, <laughs> abor. 
इनको थोड़ा कम स्पाइसी थोड़ा कम स्पाइसी आई टोल्ड हिम टू मेक इट अटल लेस स्पाइसी विल जस्ट सी हाउ इज मेकिंग इट ये क्या बना रहे सर अच्छा ये पानी पूरी इज पुटिंग द पोटेटो इन साइड दैट पूरी एंड देन यू ऑल्सो पुट पानी इन साइड दैट एंड यू ईट इट इन वन गो हाय हाउ आर यू गुड टू सी यू मैम द चिल्ड्रन प्लेइंग इन साइड देयर किसका come my buddy all are welcome on my channel please subscribe to my channel all of you guys so then cheers cheers you got try mm i love it wow it is good it's really good yeah the water the is cold are not that bad yeah we didn't make it spicy i told him to make it less spicy mm. Oh, what happened to? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is it spicy for you? No. The maram na we can taking. What you guys are calling not spicy? <laughs> <laughs> She found it way too spicy. Is it hot meat? Yeah, Would you like to end the vlog with me? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it was nice meeting you know seeing the Indian community here in Kenya. It was really really nice. So interesting to know you know they have built their own locality here. and it's like you know having indians in uk they're taking over england i believe but i'll end my vlog here itself guys do like share comment and subscribe to my channel i shall see you in my next vlog bye 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 bhavesh <laughs> something very very easy like is it easy for for you to make great and live here no not like chinese okay chinese chinese. chinese is easier because they come as investors even those guys are investors The Indians that are coming here. Yeah. And the process is harder for them. Yes. How so? Look, right now, mm. right now, mm. no one wants to invest in Kenya. Mm. I don't want to mention the yeah, name. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and right now even the investors are moving out of Kenya. Yeah, I know. Why? Well, so the, there are so many reasons. Yeah. <laughs> the Indian community here in Kenya. Okay. Is there a temple or another place that you recommend that we go visit? While okay, we I will recommend you to go to the first temple. Okay, where? There are three things in Mombasa. Mm. Not three, four things. Well, Why is it that they complain only about Indians? They do not complain because there's a lot of lab casual laborers who are uh, employed by Africans, by black Africans, right? But they do not say the same thing about uh, the African employ employers, but they complain a lot that the Indians bosses mistreat them. No, let me tell you the reality. 